As the war in Ukraine continues, some 20 percent of its territory is now in the hands of Russia. Thousands of civilians have died, millions have been displaced with no end yet in sight. Chen Minjung has the latest. A hundred days of war in Ukraine, and now a fifth of the country's land is under Russian control. This is according to Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky on Thursday, who added that the Donbas region is almost entirely destroyed. As of now, nearly 20 percent of our territory is under the control of occupiers, almost 125,000 square kilometers. Nearly 12 million Ukrainians became internally displaced people, including more than 5 million, mainly women and children, who went abroad. According to the latest report published by the United Nations, more than 9,100 civilian casualties have been confirmed since the onset of war in February. Of them, 4,100 people have been killed. The UN says that most of the casualties were caused by the use of explosive weapons. The damage has been severe for children, too. According to Ukraine's education ministry, at least 1,800 schools have been damaged or destroyed. Save the Children says that more schools have been damaged or destroyed in the past 100 days than in the first seven years after fighting broke out in 2014. This has disrupted education for some 7.5 million children living in Ukraine. Meanwhile, after a meeting with U.S. President Joe Biden, NATO Secretary General Jens Stoltenberg said that the Allies are not expecting this war to end so soon. Wars are by nature unpredictable, uh, and uh, uh, therefore uh, we just have to be prepared for the long haul, uh, because what we see is that uh, this war has now become a war of attrition. With the war ongoing, Zelensky has called for continued global attention on the Ukrainian crisis as the world's interest on the matter on social media has shown to be waning. Chemin Dang, Arirang News.